Okay guys, today I'm out here by myself, hoping to catch some rainbow trout. I just saw a few uh, surface, I just saw a surface, so there's another one right there. It's probably going to be a pretty good day. Um, it's probably going to pick up pretty fast if they start biting, so yeah, hopefully catch some trout, get a fun video so you guys can see how to do this. Once again, it's at the cove at Harriman Springs, if you can see that sign. So yeah, let's catch some fish. This is season one, episode one of the fishing show. Okay guys, basically what we're rigging up today is a purple J hook with some barbs on it. The last time I was here, they weren't um, uh, getting hooked as well on the J hook as they were on the small treble, but the small trebles also weren't um, dislodging from their mouths as easily so I'm just going to be using the J hook today to make that process easier save the fish some pain save me some hooks so I don't have to cut them off um, and then up up above the hook probably goes for about I don't know let me get it here probably goes for about two feet, two and a half, and then we have a swivel and a little egg weight type thing that sits on the bottom, and we need to, so that's just what we're doing today, and we're going to put a worm on, just like a half a worm, and see what we catch. Okay guys, first fish, just caught him, I'll set this down. Hang on a second, guys. Okay, first rainbow trout. Not bad. Not bad. The colors on these fish are pretty good today. So if I can just get them to settle down. Find the hook. Take it out nice and easy. Okay. This fish is probably going to have to have the line cut. Occasionally that'll happen, but that's no biggie. We might go barbless, you know, just because it'll help when they take it in a bit deeper. But yeah, I'm going to cut the line on this one so he can get away safe. And yeah. Okay. Off he goes. Okay guys, I'm going to quickly show you how to um, simply make a hook that has barb, somewhat barbless. You just want to take your pliers and you can smash down the barbs. Because it's no fun, um, like you guys saw with that first fish, when they, when they um, swallow it a bit more than usual and it makes them bleed a bit. Usually it's not a problem, but sometimes it will actually grab the gills and then when you go to reel them, reel them in it'll pull them up and so you'll end up having to keep a fish and it's just not fun because generally 
I'm a catch and release person. So you're just going to take the hook, <clears throat> take the barbs, kind of clamp them down. Sometimes they'll break off. That's even better. That way, you may not, the hook might, the fish might slip off the hook, but it's not going to hurt the fish as much when you're taking the hook out. And that's a darn shame because I just broke the eye off this hook when I was trying to do that, but normally it won't happen, so just, that's how you do it. I'll just set that up for the next one and then we'll get back in the water. Finally. I probably attempted to set the hook like four or five times before actually bringing one in. And look at that. See, that's that's the perfect hook set probably. That's, that's close to what you want to get, just right through the lip, not too deep. But these things are too, just freaking slippery, man. And with that, with that um, barbless hook, I can take the hook out with my fingers doesn't cause the fish much pain so we'll get this one back and then we'll continue fishing that was good that was good okay guys just caught another one I decided to have the camera ready touch it as the fish was biting because I was losing too many fish that way so we got another one here. Pretty nice colors on these fish. This one's a bit smaller than the first few it seems. So there you go. You can see this is the rainbow trout. Um, most effective in cold water native to like streams, rivers, lakes, etc. But it's also a popular game fish and is stocked in a lot of the public ponds. So that's the species we've been targeting on this episode today. Thank you for watching. Um, please subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Almost to forget to film the release. Off he goes.